Let's go, bitch. phenomenal outside it's 14 degrees celsius canadian and that might not be warm if you convert it to fahrenheit most of you are um american it's not that warm but to us canadians this is like no jacket weather this is weather that you can go um just you know without a jacket i do have a long sleeve torrid activewear kind of Thing of a jig and i was like wow the weather's nice today i've been in the house the entire week and i know i have events coming up next week but i'm like you know what i really need to get out today i need to get out get some fresh air get some steps in and get a coffee i got a coffee from starbucks this is coffee with milk oh yeah this is with oat milk three pumps of sugar-free vanilla and oat milk instead of regular milk because you guys know I'm trying to stay away from dairy because I think it's breaking my body out I get like hormonal acne and I feel like like butt knee and stuff and I feel like dairy is a big reason why um so right now I am in the Home Depot parking lot what a surprise I've never been here with you guys anyways so yeah like I said weather is perfect the weather is stunning and um as I mentioned, I don't know if I uploaded this video yet, but I mentioned, oh fuck, no, I can't, whatever. I mentioned that I need new lights for the kitchen. There's two kitchen lights that are so dark and so gloomy. And I got them because they're LED lights that you can change. You can change the color of them. Like you can set it to like cool white, warm white, pink, blue, red, whatever, like every single color but they are so glitchy and I think the house's wiring is too um, old for that type of technology being installed into the house's wiring. So um, yeah, I'm just going to look for kitchen lights that are just regular lights that you can get light bulbs in and I might just buy them today. I don't know. I might just like window shop. So I'm just gonna take you guys with me. <laughs> And I'm in my like typical going out outfit. This is my uniform whenever I go out because it's simple, it's classic, it's sleek. I'm wearing such cute sneakers from Torrid. Oh my God, what if, if I can, if I get like an aisle that's empty, I'm gonna show you guys my entire outfit because it's such a vibe. And then I also have this purse. This is the purse from Teddy Blake. They actually sent it to me for free and I did like a sponsored video for them for um, TikTok, but that's going up April 15th. Oh, and by the way, today's April 1st. This is my birthday month officially. I am an Aries. I'm on the cusp of being an Aries and a Taurus. I'm April 19th. So everyone that's born in April, shout out. Shout out to all my Aries people. Well, and, and, and also end of March people, but yeah i'm so excited i'm in a good mood today good weather honestly brings me out good mood brings a good mood out of me and i also wanted to quickly mention before i leave and go in that i have two events coming up one event is on tuesday and it's for like a skincare brand and it's just like going into them they, they have it like a space downtown toronto that i believe that they set up like a nice um like influencer event there so i'm going there but i'm also and you guys i don't know if this video is probably going to be out after or, or after it but i am going to film the footage there because i got invited to a media influencer event and there's going to be a special performance by nelly ah! <laughs> as in nelly as in it's getting hot in here so take off all your clothes i am getting so hot i'm gonna take my clothes off yes that nelly and I cannot wait. Like, I am, like, shook. I'm like, oh, my God. Like, I'm so excited. So, it's going to be at the St. Regis Hotel, which is a... I looked it up because I've heard of it, but I've never been to it. 
it's downtown Toronto it is a five-star hotel and this event is happening in their event room I believe like I said facing Bay Street Bay Street is a street downtown so I'm gonna take you guys with me I don't really ever take you guys with me when I go to influencer events just because there's so much going on there's like people talking to you constantly not that I hate that I enjoy that I want to talk to people but it just feels awkward for me to just take out the camera and start filming everything and filming people but I think that I'm going to start changing that because these are, after all, influencer events and it is where people go to film and take content and capture the footage for the event, right? So I might as well take advantage and show you guys that I actually do something. I'm not just always at home. I'm not always just filming at home all the time, even though it always feels like I am because I am really. <laughs> I don't really ever leave my house. I don't really have a need to leave my house. I get my groceries delivered. I do my work from home. I um, do content at home. Like I'm pretty much good at home. Like I have everything I need at home. So yeah, but let's go out, right? Let's enjoy ourselves. Okay, so I'm gonna stop rambling. Thank you for sticking with me um, through this part of the video. Thank you for continuing to watch. And hold on, because I want to show you guys my sunglasses before I go in. But I can't even find them now. Oh, here they are. So I got these new sunglasses. They're from Torrid. Oh my gosh, Torrid has the best sunglasses ever. Because they're like oversized sunglasses. And I love oversized sunglasses. So these are them. If you guys want them, I'll link them down below. But they're just so cute. They're so classic, so chic like everything absolutely everything but they're i can't really see out of them like i can but they're so tinted they're so tinted so i'm just gonna maybe clean them a bit before i go in oh my god what is all this red oh from my purse the red suede all right so let's i guess go into home depot wish me fucking luck because girl i'm a i'm a girl i'm a big old girl with a little bit of see-through leggings my leggings are kind of bit see-through but luckily my <laughs> my um my jacket will cover my butt all right so let's go you guys let's go into home depot let's go we're going to home depot we're going to home depot everything you can find is at home depot Where do oh, there's the lake over there. Woo! Some of these are a bit too extravagant. Like, I don't need a whole rendition, a whole rendition like that. Something simple, something that like latches, I guess. Like, you see, these lights are kind of too dim for me. Too dim. We don't want that color, but I guess. Oh, I see the glass. See how the glass inside has like coppered, I don't know, a coppered feel to it. This one's not so bad. Actually, no, that's really ugly. That looks like like a ship, like you got it from a ship. I don't know how to explain it, like a ship. Oh my god, I love this song. It's freaking Janet Jackson. Only man is man, you love me too. Okay, those are so pretty. I might have to do a voiceover, you guys, because of the music. I, I, I need my love for you. Can't believe my dreams come true. This is very much prestigious. I love you. I can't believe my dreams come true. Okay, these lights are stunning. Oh my god, I actually, bitch. Look at this chandelier. Should I get this for my beauty room, you guys? Just because? <laughs> no, but for real. Oh my god. That one up there is so pretty. Hey, y'all. So I ended up getting those two lights as I showed you guys.
body. These are cute. Oh my gosh, those lights are gorge. She got the bag. She got the subway bag. Let's go, beach. So I got a turkey sub with spicy dill pickle, Miss Vicky chips. I don't know if anyone in America has those chips, but yes, us Canadians have it. Oh my gosh. So I got turkey, bacon, and cheese, and fixings, all the veggies, and some honey mustard. It was so good, you guys. And then these are how the lights look like and i love you guys i love how it turned out it brightened up the space so wonderfully and it just looks good so yes yeah, successful it's very bright now i'm back at home i actually went back out to my local nail salon store to get some products i seriously just needed these boards these um emery boards but <laughs> you know me i have to when i'm at a store i like to look around i like to, I like to take my time and see what else i need so I got like six of these because the ones I have right now are like not gritty anymore. I use them too much so they're not gritty. So I just got six of these OPI ones. Some are some ones 180 and 400 and then 150. I just got like a bunch of different ones because I like to shape my nails that way. And don't mind my room. My room is kind of a mess right now but it is what it is. I got myself some um this is a foot file a foot e-file i got two different ones i got one that is thicker or not thicker got one with bigger holes and one with smaller holes um my feet are quite cheddar cheese right now quite swiss quite a bit of um you know parmesan at the moment so i need to scrape the shit out of them and who knows maybe i could save the shavings and put it on top of my pasta after <laughs> so disgusting but yeah, this is salon grade foot files, but you gotta be so careful with these because they're pretty sharp. Like look how sharp that is. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna give myself a pedicure. I like doing my nails at home. It's really fun to paint nails and like work on your own nails. I do my own nails as you can see. I have, I have so many nail products, it's insane. The pandemic really made me get into nails and like working on my own nails. It was just a really fun hobby. And this is the, this one would be good for your heel if you're really, you know, crunchy at the heel. Perfect for you. And then I actually got these because these are a sample of color swatches. So I have a lot of different acrylic powders and I want to practice with them because my acrylic, acrylic application is you know, not where it needs to be because I'm still so new at it. So it'd be kind of nice to practice with, um, with these. So these are just like little, you know, samples that you pretty much put on here, this ring, and then you can have a bunch of different colors so you know what is what. So I'm living for that idea. I've always wanted to do that, but I just never got around to it. 
And I have so many colors. I'll show you guys my like acrylic powder collection. I have a lot. And I needed this because I needed an instrument to cut down my nail length. The other one that I have isn't that great, so I had to get a new one. Because it got like pretty dull, so it's not cutting as strong as it needs to. And this this looks like that. And you pretty much, it's for long nails, you put your nail through and then you just cut it. Cute. And then, I got these. I like to do my toes regular polish. I don't do gel, I don't do shellac anymore. Because it's very difficult to get off and then when it chips, it's so hard to like remove. So I just like a nice regular nail polish for the toes. And I don't even know, I might have these colors because I'm an idiot, but I saw them like, they're so cute. This one is called Baby Take a Bow. It's just really pretty pink color and I love pink. I love pink so much, pink toenails. And then I got this one, this is called Throw Me a Kiss. And it's sort of a shimmery color, cute. And then I just got a regular top coat. Let me show you the colors. Hold on, let me show you my colors that I have right now. Miss Girl in Long Time. Um, okay. okay. So, this is my entire polish collection so far. These are the colors. This, oh, thank God. This is Getting Natty on My Honeymoon. And this one is It's a Girl by OPI. And this one is Let's. Be friends by Hello Kitty. So yeah, I just wanted some cute colors for toes because I'm gonna be wearing a lot of open toe shoes now with summer rolling around and especially when I have to go to events. And then these are all my gel polishes from Kiara Sky. I spent an arm and a leg for them. So I do have a lot of Kiara Sky dip powders. This is my collection of the dip powders. Yum. And Apparently acrylic powders are different than dip powders, although some people argue that they're not different at all and you can use them as the same thing. These are all my Kiara Sky dip uh, acrylic powders. Their gel polishes are great, but so expensive. But, you know, I had to get them because it's Kiara Sky. I like the brand a lot. And yeah, the colors are cute. Look at these colors. This is called For Shore. It's like a blue. This one is just a dark pink. That one's perfect for like French manicure. This one's morning dew. I actually have, this one is the one I have on my nails right now. And pink and polish, just some really, really, really nice colors. If, and I also have another tray of them. These are some off brands that I bought. Well, not off brands, but other brands that I purchased from. This is Nitro. The nitro and this is daisy daisy's pretty popular too this nice bright pink so i have a lot of colors that's for sure and i love doing my nails i love it love it love it if you guys want me to do a doing my nail video please let me know if you're interested in that because i'd love to do that but the thing is it takes so long to do so it might be a little bit of a hassle to to film it but i'm sure that you know that might do well if you're interested in it. Thank you so much for following me around Home Depot today. I had like a really productive day today. The weather is funny because the weather now is very gloomy and then I got a notification saying that there's going to be a storm, I'm going to get a severe thunderstorm. So I'm kind of living for that because now I'm at home, it's all cozy and I don't mind storms. If I'm not outside in the storm, I don't mind them and if they're not gonna you know hurt anyone i don't mind them but yeah storms are cute <laughs> anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video if you guys like these types of videos if you like these type of like everyday kind of videos like what i do where i'm doing and how i'm doing it let me know and please subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next one bye